<laughs> Go ahead and reach in that box on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pull them out. Pull them out. Oh! <laughs> what up, Rep Pack? It's your boy here, King Reptar. Back with another video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. And if you guys aren't, you know the drill. Blind camera. Camera. Oh, right. Camera. Right. Camera. Flip. Oh, <laughs> go ahead, take that back. All right, today we are gonna be blind, all right? We're gonna be using this right here, this beanie, Parker. Go ahead and feel this beanie. Wait, wh why is it wet? <laughs> I don't know. It's disgusting. It's lightly damp and it's suspect. Is that, your, is that sweat? Is that is that water? Soda? Unknown fluid. That's disgusting. <laughs> That's even worse. We're gonna be using that to blindfold ourselves today. Right here, usually the box says what we're doing. Blindfold challenge. Right here, we are gonna be doing a blindfold challenge. On this channel, we open up all types of products, and in particular, anime stuff. As of recently, I have been absolutely obsessed with so many different shows. I mean, maybe because I got Crunchyroll like two months ago. Oh, you did? Yeah, I ate the entire roll. <laughs> But what we're gonna be doing today is testing our knowledge. You know, we, we put our hands on quite a lot of things. You know, some firm Respectfully thing. and, and con consentfully, of course. Yeah. But Point back is. to the anime, yeah. <laughs> we are gonna test our knowledge on the type of product. I mean, we touch different types of things every single day. Some of us more than others. But <laughs> <laughs> we touch different things every single day and we also look at the items. We try and guess the prices on them. I'm looking them up 24 seven so I can add it to our collection as the rep pack. But do these hands have the knowledge within them or is it all in the vaniculars. It's in the, it's in the brain. That's neither. Yeah, it's my eyes. I'm saying my no, vaniculars. That, okay, first off, uh, they're not called vaniculars. <laughs> Second, that's not where the information my is. My omnioculars. <laughs> <laughs> But we are going to be putting our blindfold on, aka this suspect fluid filled beanie. We're going to be covering up our eyes and we're going to be reaching our hand into this box. Uh, and we're going to grab the item out and we're going to see who can guess it based on just feeling it. And it is all anime based products. And the other person's design is to give us hints along the way, but it can only relate to the show. Are you ready? I think so. Well, then let's get started. Oh. All right, it's been decided. Everybody's voted. Who? Wait. Me. <laughs> What's been decided? I'm going first. Oh, okay. okay. I should have seen that one. Okay. I'm going first. That was my fault. So that way you can understand what winning looks like. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and throw the bean on. And Parker, I swear to god, if you touch me like you did last time. What? I just wanted to say set that up and make people think you did yeah, something. Yeah, it <laughs> made me think I did something perverted, yeah. Uh, the best. I'm telling HR. <laughs> Alright, I got the fold on. What I'm gonna do, go ahead, Parker, test me. See if I can see. Put the money in the bag. <laughs> Alright. I don't know what you're doing, but it's pissing me off. Yeah, I'm not doing anything. Well, test me. I did. <laughs> well, test me again. Ask me something. It's not going to cover your hearing. <laughs> <laughs> what? What is the... Do you remember what the tape says? Let me go ahead and um, read that. It says... Oh, sorry. Blindfold challenge. I told you to wrote it! I, I don't know what you want from me here. <laughs> you gotta give me some kind of visual test, Parker. Oh, visual test. Okay. Yes. Um, okay, well, how many, how many fingers am I holding up? Four. No. I can't see anything. How many fingers am I holding up? Three. All right, prove it to the people then. Try and do something. I mean, try and make me flinch. You just, because you know I'm not going to hit you, so there's no reason to flinch. No, I'm not. What do you mean? What? I can't see anything. I can't see, right? <laughs> Confirm? Uh, yes, I, I think so. Not the even question blink. is, do you see this? I, I, I see everything that's going on. Yes. Not even blinking. I, I can't see that. Here we go. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to reach in here. I'm going to grab it. We're going to put 30 seconds on the clock. Go ahead and get a timer out, Parker. I got to try and figure it out within that time. If not, you give me my first hint. We see how many points we can get. Whoever wins gets everything in the box. Let's go. All right, I'm gonna need you to tell me. I'm the one who's impaired right now. Burger. What? Oh, oh, timer's gone. I let you left. Okay, here we go. Grabbing my first item out of here. Let's see what we got. It feels solid. All right, so what do we got here? It feels like a check from grandma. Looks nice, looks nice. Oh! <laughs> feels like I'm holding some corporate checks, man. What is this? What's in the box still? Oh! Damn. Okay. Is this valuable? It looks valuable. No, they're in plastic, bro. Yeah. Oh, these are, these are definitely some kind of coin. Another coin. Uh, okay, go ahead and hit me my first hint. This is a valuable token in a show we both like. A valuable token? Yeah, you can kind of say it's some sort of uh, some sort of currency. I can feel now that you say currency, it does feel like coins. Maybe these are dollar bills. Oh, do you remember? I remember those SpongeBob metallic bills uh -huh, uh -huh. and they kind of felt like like these. And there's also the Naruto ones, remember? I think these are, I don't know, man. I think they're shingles, I don't know. What are these? This is the thing I don't know. I really, these are the things that are tripping me out. Like I know these, I feel like they, they are, are the... in a case. Oh, they're in a case? Yes. 
Oh, this is a coin, like a mint coin. Pokemon coins and cash. Because Ash is a loud personality. Is that your final guess? They do, they feel riveted, and I'm pretty confirmed. Like, honestly, I'm confirmed at this point, these are the the gold anime dollars. I don't know what show it is, that's my problem. So then what's your final guess? My show? final guess, can I get one more hint about the character? Yellow. Definitely Pokemon then. Is that your final guess? Yeah. It's not, it's Naruto. Damn! <laughs> I only said that because there literally is a big a Pokemon one coming. Oh man. Damn it. And I thought because we already sewn the Naruto ones before. Oh, but these are the actual brand. So we I actually have all the different brands coming. So this is the actual remember we opened up those gold dollars before? These are the actual brand. So I, yeah, I thought those were just like kind of custom. I didn't know there was a real brand or whatnot. No, those ones were knockoffs. So let's take a little closer look at them. We got the Sasuke bill. And dude, these ones look so much better than the other ones. Oh, yeah. And then right here we got Sage Mode Naruto, and all of these were released for right here the Naruto 25th and our 20th anniversary right here, man. Oh, they're so sick. And then we got Itachi right here, and I could say as somebody who ordered the knockoffs, there was so much texture and consistency everywhere. These ones are just clean and crispy, and I gotta make sure I keep them in good shape. And Jiraiya, is there wow. Any on the backs? Yeah, these are all the same oh, on the okay, back, kind of like you know our currency. And then the box. Oh, there's a certificate. 24 karat gold coin certificate. Get up. Authenticity. 99.9% 24 karat gold plated. Limited to 10 pieces. Ooh. Holy crap. It I was, was really going. feeling those up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I didn't know it was in a, a case. That's what made it so much harder. So we so have 10, like, of the 10 cases. of these cases. And you have one of them? Mm -hmm. Dude, and these coins are absolutely beautiful. Take a look at the coins individually. There's. Oh! Damn! The headbands on them, and they're actual 24 karat gold plated, man. And you just took a nap. And freaking note out of the Pokemon book here. Holy crap. Those are amazing. Who do you think deserves to go in the middle here? Obviously Naruto. Yeah, I don't know why I asked that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I guess I did kind of get the thing, but I didn't get the show, and that was my bad. So I get no points for this round. We got nothing on the board, but this item will go into the box as a collective pot. If the person actually gets the item they guess, you can keep the item, but if you get it wrong, it goes in the collective pot. That way, whoever gets the most points at the end of the game gets the entire thing. Right there, KL the World Collection with the KL certificates. That was an awesome box. Let's go ahead and get back in the box. It's Parker's turn to put on. Oh, it's really suspect now. The suspect beanie. It's your time. Put the beanie on, man. Yeah. It's your time to be Can blindfolded. I just, like, close my eyes? All right, go ahead and sleeve that head up. Oh my god! <laughs> you look like you've been trying to get the upgrade on your wheels on your truck for years. <laughs> All right, Parker. Mm -hmm. So when you're ready, go ahead. You smell it? Uh, it's probably the lawn clippings outside. That you don't means... smell that weird smell. Kind of like a weird. Smell. Yeah, I worked out this morning. Did, did you shower? That's why there's a weird smell. Okay. This is not part of the box. Yes, no, it is. Dude, you can take off the mask. I don't. What? You can take off the mask. Oh. It's a bacon breakfast. Oh. Oh. That's been in the fridge for quite a while. But. Why would you throw it away? Because it's good food, Parker. All right, attempt number two. Going back in the box. I really don't know what to do with this bacon what? at this point. I don't know why you still have that. It's kind of like a meat pom pom. <laughs> All right, go ahead and reach in that bag, theater thug, and grab the first item you can feel. <laughs> Yeah, man. Let's go ahead and see what you got here. Obviously. Oh, oh that's a Funko Pop. Very perceptive. You got it. That was like magic. Go ahead and show it to the people real well, quick. Like, uh, go ahead and show it to the people whatever I know it's it is. exclusive. It's, oh. it's, it's a rectangle, so I'm just going to go with... It could be GameStop. It could be Hot Topic. I, I said, a, I said a hint. I said it was magical. If Houdini was black, he would be a... <laughs> <laughs> say it. I want you to say it. Dark Magician Hot Topic. Yes, you got it. That was a good hit, man. So Parker did get it right. He got a Hot Topic exclusive. I honestly was gonna say if you couldn't get it, you were gonna be able to open the box up and fill the pop itself. But you well, were able to get it. With, gave it to me. Yeah, with that great ass hint. <laughs> I, I, I guess I will give that to you. Yeah, that was a great hint. All right. All right, I'm grabbing my item out of here. Uh, uh, okay, you grab, you grab something. A box is already open. Oh. We got a, why does this feel like, you know those Bibles they hand out for free? Oh, you could be. no, 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 no. This is um like those mini binders, like the um like the Pokemon ones that come with the booster pack. Oh, the ones you throw away? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah for sure. I think it's one of those. Oh, this is definitely like um like a, a blister, obviously. Okay. Doesn't feel like a figure. That was a card thing. I'm gonna go with some kind of theme deck. The, I feel like you're kind of right. Another one. There. They're all the same thing though. Sick. 
Damn! They're all the same! Okay. <laughs> so, can I have a hint as to if they're... I mean, obviously, I would say they have to be Naruto or Pokemon binders, because it's only... Or they could be okay. Yu-Gi-Oh, but I, I doubt that. I don't know too much about this thing. You are basically kind of correct. All you gotta do is fill in the blank. Are you ready? Yeah. Saved by the... Lifeguard. Inside edition. Saved by the... No, no, I gotta know. Drake... Bell. It's Bell. <laughs> okay, that, that's your hint. That's... Bell yeah. and theme decks. Yeah. Okay, so what are there anything different between the theme decks or are they all the same theme deck? Uh they're all different. No, so they're all different. Um there there's two with the same character. I'm guessing he's the main character. Uh all three. What does the main them, character look like? His hair is yellow. You asked, man. Is it Naruto again? No. This looks like some sort of some sort of spell book. Death Note. Is it Death Note? No. Oh, what am I thinking? I know what I don't it is. Know what you're thinking? I know what it is. What is the it? only thing is, I don't even know if this has a card game. Oh, what I do? Zatch Bell. Zatch Bell. There we go. Yes. Okay, I got it. The only reason I remembered that is because I have that Zatch Bell booster box. I never really thought about them having. Oh, those are sick. I think they're sick. I don't even know what they are, man. Like, so in the show, this is like. I think this would be. Yeah, this is like Zatch Bell's spell book. He owns him. So like, you know how if you're a Zatch Bell fan, this is easy to explain. But if you're not, this is really hard. Um, you know, like, where you even start? The devil. <laughs> in Japan, there's yeah. demons it's called Shinigami. They're in Death Note. There's a lot of other shows, but uh. this little thing right here is a Shinigami. He's a demon puppet, and he is in control by this guy. And the cool thing is, is that the demon's not in control, so Zatch Bell, he's super, super, like, peaceful and super calm. But for example, look at this guy. Oh, wow. He just screams evil. But he got with an owner that's not evil, so it's kind of like a counterbalance. There is bad ones, there are good ones, but the cool thing is the theme decks are actually based off of the actual spell books from the show. And man, I gotta say it, I don't even think I'm gonna open these. Let's just take a look at the backs right here and look at them. We got Zatch Bell right there with this fish. He eats the fish's whole, Parker. Yes. <laughs> Let's go ahead and take a look at the back of this one right here. And ooh, I think I wanna open that one. Cause imagine we get this thing graded. Well, you can say that. Well, that's a slippery slope because then it's like, okay, well, why don't I just get another set and then just open that all, all four, you know? Oh, where's that slope and give me the baby oil? I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we found out these are not like super, super, super expensive yet. So I'm gonna go ahead and open up this one because I really remember this character. I can't even remember his name right now, but I remember this character. I thought he was badass. I mean, he looks sick. Oh, you know, that's not even the card, dude. Why is it like you say it's like my fault? Yeah. Because I thought that was like a full art that was in the back right here. That's so Wait, lame. Wait, open it up. Let's just see like what else is in there before Okay, we so we got page. this right here, this page shield. Now that's sick. Like that's dope. But what the hell is a page shield? Like this is something to go in between like your cards to divide them. I thought this was like a full art card. I thought so too. I mean, what about that? That's a this card. Yeah, this is just cards. We can open these up too because we already got it open. But I'm a little disappointed. I thought that was gonna be like an epic full art. All right, you ready to see some monsters? Yeah. Flying bat or flying beat? Cut is that a crayon. <laughs> This is a glue stick with a scissors on his back. Any Hiroshi. bald buff guy ever. <laughs> we got flying beat I again. Yeah. Oh, but this one's um majestic twelve. Oh dang, okay. Whatever that means. Cut and paste. I'm energized. <laughs> we got hey, Brago. That's, that's the hollow. That's the hollow rare. Zatch Bell himself. Can't go wrong with that. With the fish. Brago. Oh, what? Am I looking at Keo? Oh, that's my favorite guy right here. Why is his name Parco? <laughs> and why does he have hearts on his nipples? This guy, his demon, or his his <laughs> this these guys are a duo. <laughs> and this guy is an Italian superstar. No, he's not. He is. He's an Italian superstar. And he's an Italian accent the whole show. And his name is Parco. Yes. Oh, this is not good. <laughs> Sherry. Tikapuru. Damn! B Mac. Yeah. Damn. Oh, d Jesus. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's just go ahead and call it quits right there. Let's go ahead and get into Parker's turn. I get the point. All right. Are you ready? You know it. All right, Holmes. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead and reach in that box, Holmes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pull them out. Pull them out. Yes, man. I've been waiting for you to pull that out. I saw that last time you went. And I purposely didn't aim for it. Right here. Why do you want me to open it? Why do you I want don't know, because they're sick, and I wanted to see them visually oh, right in the open. Blind. Okay, yeah. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to say you're probably going to hit that plastic off first. Yeah. All right. So oh, go ahead and pull them out. These are, these are shoes. But what kind of shoes are they? Damn. <laughs> Those 
are fire. <laughs> they ain't easy. So. <laughs> <laughs> I can tell that. Just leathery. Check them out. I mean, these <laughs> are. Check them out. I'm talking to the rep pack. This is insane. I never thought this would ever become a thing. This is an official product. Go ahead and you can tell it's a shoe, right? <laughs> yes, I, yes, I've uh, discussed this. <laughs> what would you describe the shoe it's as? Almost like a what, like a high top. Like a high top what? Not like high top Vans, but very close. Leathery Converse slash Vans. Okay, I will tell you that it is based off of a particular character. Let me think of how I can give you a hint without giving you the answer. I'll give you a hint, two hints. First one, so you can guess the show. If you were to wear these shoes, I hope it would be silent since they're made for a ninja. Oh, okay. Well, I appreciate the hint, yes. What is it from? Taruto? Yes. <laughs> okay, if you were to wear these shoes, I think there's a chance you might get lost in the journey of life. Hey man, take a honey to the beach in these, you'd be a make-out paradise. I feel like Oh, now I know what it is. Now I know what it is. I was like, that was like a dead giveaway. Yeah, that's what Kakashi says. He says, I got lost in the journey of life. And then he said, make it a paradise. Oh, are, you, are you there? <laughs> <laughs> you are, we're going to do the mask off. You'll find out. Are you right? Yes. Yes, you're right. <laughs> yeah. I was like, <laughs> go ahead and get something. This is what I was feeling for. <laughs> go ahead and show them that side of it real quick. This this is felt. This it's... is felt. And then this is grip. These are moonwalking shoes. <laughs> <laughs> I guess for silence. Ooh, or am I reading too far into this? That could be it because only on the tips. I can see the price right here. Okay. Do you think you'd pay 50 bucks? This is what it feels like to be the other pair of sneakers next to that pair of sneakers is not getting picked. <laughs> yeah, about 50 bucks. Maybe not 50 on the nose, but like. Like I'm gonna go bucks. ahead. What size there in the inside? I'm gonna try the shoes on. We'll see how they look as an aesthetic. I mean, I'm not wearing an outfit that goes with this, but we'll still see how they look, see how comfortable they are, and see if they're silent ninja shoes. Okay, like, I was gonna try them on, but I think that, you know, my feet are too big. <laughs> <laughs> you scared the neighbors. You're like, oh my god, how big of a car this could he be? Yeah, I actually kind of like these though. They're pretty, they're not the most comfortable <laughs> shoes. What is wrong with these, huh? It makes your foot look so small. I don't think that you look that small. They make him look small. Like, I know your foot is, like, average. I think what? it's your moment to try to, oh, oh, my hands have been so small for all these <laughs> years. My hands have been so small for all this time. Let me get Marcus his moment for small feet. Not happening, bro. Well, first off, you do have small feet. I have a preposterously big feet. Preposterously? I'm like Daffy Duck in this... That well, that reduces your daffy stuff. <laughs> but on the real though, I actually like this shoe. This shoe is small on me. This is a size nine. I wear a size eleven if certain sneakers. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes a ten and a half, but usually they don't have that, so I go with an eleven. <laughs> this is really weird. It just makes your foot look really small. I mean, the shoe itself looks good. You guys, let me know in the comments down below. Would you guys rock this shoe? And do you think the shoe looks good on your boy? I think I think I rock it like a seven out of ten. You'll see this later. But right now, I look like it looks like I'm looking at a 13 year old. <laughs> I'm like, I'm gonna zoom out. Okay. Oh, 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 it's a man. Oh, it's, yeah. it's a full grown man. A grown ass man with some sick ass shoes. And this, the shoes are sick. <laughs> There's our fourth item. Next up is my turn. Let's see what we got here. All right. Hey, what are you getting, doing? We're getting low on the box what here. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, shoot. I couldn't see. I couldn't see. I swear. There's these cloth items in here. And I think we both oh. understand. <laughs> this, this is hard to debate. So you're going to have to try your best to, con to, to make me figure out what these items are. Dude. Let's try and find right, out. Right Let's put a timer on the screen. Your job is to try to get, be, help me. I'm not the fastest sometimes. I'll try my best. You gotta help me try and get these answers within a minute. Let's go. All right, clock is on. <laughs> okay, so the two shirts, they're two different shows. Okay, two different shows. Both of them in- So they're not the same show, separate shows. Oh, there's a backside of that one. Oh, that is so sick. I can't wait to see it. They both involve fighting. Dragon Ball Z and Naruto. Okay, you got one right. So both involve fighting. Also, that is not the shirt in which you got the one right. Okay. This is more on you than me. <laughs> <laughs> I know, it's your job this time. Um, help me learn. Okay, um, both of these shows involve an examination process that's crucial to the base storyline of the shows. Some kind of, I love the word, exam. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay, uh -huh, uh -huh. that makes it very easy because uh -huh, uh -huh. I know exam, uh -huh. I'm thinking Hunter x Hunter. One of them is correct. And that you is... said that Dragon Ball and anime was right. Dragon Ball and Naruto was right. I said one of them's correct, I couldn't tell you which. And obviously Naruto, you have the Chunin exams. 
So it is Hunter x Hunter and Naruto. But which shirt is which? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Is that part of it? Is that what we're the getting? Naruto Hunter x Hunter. Actually, you got that right. Okay, okay. I like that shirt. We got Kilawa and we got Gone on there. That is actually dope because if Liario would have been on there, I wouldn't have worn it. Tezuka would have been awesome on the back side. Okay, this isn't the back side shirt then. This is not the back side shirt. Oh, that is dope. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that is also dope. Holy crap. Ooh. I'm really liking this box. And thank you for helping me get this one because I like these shirts. Okay, your last chance. We're both doing pretty good, but this is the tiebreaker, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure I, I, I've gotten every single one. But if you don't get this one, we're tied. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead and reach in there, grab whatever you need. Oh, you need the blindfold. Yeah, I'm guessing it's this right here. I will give you the hint up front. We recently filmed a video and this was the only character that was missing from the set. Film a lot of videos here, so we do here. No. Yeah. Go ahead and put the box down real quick. Yes, there was one character missing. If you, you want to open it, you can though. Tells me that it's a collectible. Tells me that it's some sort of figure. And we filmed the video recently. Do you need another hint? Can I open it? You can open it. All right, we went ahead and opened it for you. Obviously, there's still more to be identified, so it doesn't give up too much. Go ahead and grab it. A little lower. Just a little, a little lower. A little more to the left, right there. Yes. Yeah, that's a stand that's irrelevant. <clears throat> I wouldn't fill that middle piece too much, but yeah. Why that reveal too much, or is it like perverted? It's a perverted piece. Okay, so it tells me it's a woman. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. Is this from Demon Slayer? Yes. This is a little Q, Q figures, right? Q something? Q pocket. I feel like I know the answer because of this part right here, but I don't know if it's, it's the hair. Oh, that's what it is. This is Nezuko. God damn it, yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what Parker did feeling? get it. You were feeling her rump. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was this part right here. I was like, oh, that feels like it feels like the scroll. <laughs> yeah, all right, go ahead and build that figure as we can see it. That was the last one that was needed in the Q Pocket set. And I think that actually makes you the victor of this episode of Feel Yourself. You wouldn't feel yourself, episode one. <laughs> I think everybody assumed you were gonna win Feel Yourself, episode one. This is what this series is series called, Feel Yourself. I thought it was called a uh, blindfold challenge. That's what like the the um like the stage name is, but but less your item a challenge. <laughs> yeah, this one didn't have like a stand or anything or a it, oh. no, flu. All right, well here's a stand. I thought it was gonna have some kind of like plug-in part for her to sit on, but okay, I'm kind of glad it does because you know where would it go? <laughs> you know where it's gonna go. <laughs> <laughs> Got Nazuko. All right, guys, you know the drill. Scan it. guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys did make sure you guys smash that like button subscribe if you're new here and if you guys want to see a different variation of this game let me know down below in the comments what you guys want to see with the feeling of the stuff what do you want to see these beautiful ebony hands don't know glaze upon <laughs> You guys let me know in the comments. I appreciate you guys so much for watching this video. As always, check out this video screen right here, which is actually a video that YouTube recommends for you. And I'm going to go ahead and say you should check it out as well because apparently you haven't seen it. So I'll see you guys over there. And as always, Rep Pack, I will see you beautiful people in the next one. Adios. Boop.